hello everyone I hope that uh, you uh, have a great day today uh, today I'm going to uh, talk about uh, Java programming but then under the topics of uh, advanced uh, graphical user interface design and also the uh, how to use a graphic uh, package okay, in uh, Java okay, so for example uh, your boss asks you to produce the following maybe create okay, a Java applet okay, uh, to display a message hello world and also some graphics okay, and then maybe an oval like this okay. or your boss also wants you to okay, move the uh, description hello world at the list location and then change the color okay, of the uh, okay, wireframe okay, for this okay, uh, cylinder and also change the color okay, for this oval okay. or maybe okay, your boss okay, asks you to produce uh, something like this okay. for example create an application okay, provide uh, 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 check boxes okay, and then uh, uh, radio buttons okay and then uh, also a button a text box okay. so once some items got selected then the uh, process button is clicked then in the text field over here or text area over here uh, you're going to display the pizza type selected okay. and then the size okay. and then the toppings and then also calculate the uh, total amount okay so uh, that is what we're going to do okay uh, today so let me quickly okay, uh, show you okay, how you can quickly use the uh, NetBean software uh, to create okay, maybe a simple application like this. All right, okay, so let me get started. So let me minimize this one, okay, minimize this one, and let me fire up the NetBean software first. Okay, and then again, NetBean software is free, so okay, uh, feel free to uh, Google it and then. Uh, uh, click uh, the uh, download and then install the software okay so uh, let me show you how to create a Java applet first okay so let me click file and a new project and from the new project dialog box okay I'm going to use the default okay for the uh, categories it will be Java then the project type okay will be the Java application then I'm going to click next okay, and then over here okay if you see a check mark okay, next to the uh, create okay, um, uh, main class okay, please remove it okay, please remo remove it and then for this one I might call it Java okay, uh, applet demo uh, maybe uh, zero one okay, yeah and then again uh, project location okay, a project folder you, you pick it okay, you can change it by clicking the uh, browse button over here okay, if you want to okay. So I'm not going to change it. Okay, I'm uh, pretty happy with uh, 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 where it will be. Okay, so okay, let me click finish right now. All right. Okay, so you can see the project has been created. But then I'm going to. Okay, but then there is no source code. Okay, there is no source code at all. So I'm going to. Okay, uh, right click the mouse button here on the project. Click new, and then I'm going to from the pop up menu. I'm going to pick. Uh, Java applet, J applet, the J stands for Java, okay, Java applet, okay, so click that one, and then again, I mean, you can give a new name, okay, if you want to, otherwise, you can use a default name, so I'm going to use the default name, okay, default name, okay, so new uh, J applet, and click finish, there you go, okay, so you can see, okay, uh, here will be the source code okay so over the uh, highlight button over here okay you can see it is this you are in the source code mode okay and then okay uh, in this source code okay you you will see uh, the package you need will be the java extension x stands for extension okay a stream package and then the class name will be java applet in relation to that okay uh, the class okay have been created a moment ago okay is a default name uh, new uh, J applet and it extends the class Java applet okay and then it has a building method okay, called uh, init okay, stands for initialization however uh, if you're going to display some uh, pictures okay, some pictures okay, uh, all stream uh, all text message okay, then uh, you're going to declare okay, uh, another method called public void uh, pen Okay, pen 
print and then in there uh, you put the uh, parameter okay, graphic okay. graphic g and then the body of the method and then super dot append the parent uh, constructor class okay yeah and then g okay so it seems to me that okay uh, we might have to import okay, another class. Okay, so let's do that. Okay, yeah. Java dot awt, and let's use the wildcard. Okay, so now you can see the uh, class okay, graphics okay, uh, will be imported okay, under the uh, uh, awt okay, uh, package. Okay, all right. Okay, so okay, if you I want to run the application right now. Yeah, you can do so. Okay, so let me minimize those things. Okay, so we got more room to work with. Okay, yeah. Okay, so if you want to uh, execute the program, you can go to run and then uh, pick, uh, let me see, run file. Okay, run file. Don't pick run project. Okay, pick run file. Okay. There you go. Okay, so this is the Java ablet. Okay, and of course, I mean you can extend the size, but there's nothing there. Okay, there's really nothing there. So assume that okay, we want to display maybe some simple hello world message. Okay, so let me put the uh, uh, call the uh, uh, parameter. Okay, graphic parameter, and then I can use okay, uh, many different uh, member functions. But the one I'm going to try will be the simple one. Okay, call the draw string string. Okay, draw strings. Okay, so over here, okay, it take uh, one, two, three, three parameters. Okay, the first parameter represent what message. Okay, uh, uh, string message you want to display. Uh, the second parameter, okay, uh, represent the x coordinates coordinate, and then uh, the third parameter represent the value for the y coordinate. Okay, so uh, let me click that one, and then we're going to try a simple one. Hello, word. Okay, and then for the uh, location. Okay, let me put uh, maybe uh, twenty. Okay, for the x coordinate, and then forty for the y coordinate. Okay. All right, okay, so let me run again. Okay, so go to run. Again, don't pick run project. Okay, please pick uh, run file. Okay, run file. There you go. Okay, so you can see, okay, according to the coordinates, okay, the x okay, uh, coordinate will be about here. Okay, will be about here. And then, uh, okay, sorry, will be about here. And then y, okay, 40, okay, will be from here, okay, will be from here, okay, so the point of origin, okay, is at here, okay, and then this is the message, okay, this is the message. Of course, I mean, we can change the font size, okay, uh, font color, uh, font face, font style, blah, 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 okay, many things, but let me keep it simple, okay, so let me just stop over here, okay, yeah. 